in. Are we live? We're in the right place this time. Okay. We were chatting for the last two minutes. Just talking to, to ourselves. ourselves. Which, you know. But the people were saying good morning, so maybe they could see it. Don't know. Maybe it was oh, somewhere else. We're on. Ah! <laughs> Kylie, what's that beautiful carpet? I know, have? isn't it beautiful? I feel like I'm camping, but in my house. Where did these come from? These were some new supply items from Stampin' Up. They are the Happy Trails mugs. Comes Aww. as a set of two. And I like these. if you're a demonstrator, you can order these too. There's merch when you're a demonstrator. And today we're showing brand new products. Mess Jenka, hopefully we're live. Yes. We are. It's all looking good. Guten Morgen, good morning, Angela. Yeah, good to see you all. Now, I'm just testing something out. So, if I reach across Kylie. You can just ask me. Just say, comments, please. Comments, please. <laughs> hi, Paula. <laughs> hi, Miss Jenka. Hi, Sue. <laughs> hi, Jean. Jacqueline. Angela. So good to Melissa. see you all here. Our usuals. And I noticed that we have a few new ones, too. So, if you're new, let us know. If you're a friendly stalker and you're sitting in the background and you normally don't comment, hi Anne Marie. Oh, we'd love to hear from you. We'd love we'd love to get a hello. The cool thing about YouTube is that Sorry. all of your friends and followers are not going to see it. So don't stress if you say hello. I don't think it's going to happen there. No, it doesn't look like it. It's only got Facebook on there. Oh, it's yeah. bizarre. Anyway, so um, we were testing out new things. So today we're going to show you new product now why would we show you new product when you can't buy it if you're you a can customer buy it. what you can, what you buy, it. You can buy anybody it anybody can get this if you live in one of the countries that stampin up is off is offering yeah is self products in <laughs> where they offer products where they yeah. offer products yeah. if you're a demonstrator you can order these products now how if, if you're not, as a part of the pre-order you just log on but how do you do that if you're a customer? If you're a no, demonstrator, I said it, you can that's order. That's what I said. If, yeah. I'm a, if you're a demonstrator, yeah. you can order these products. If you're a customer, you can order these products too. You just have to join someone's team. <laughs> and you if you join. live in Australia, we would love for you to join our team. Yeah. We would love for you to have opportunity to get, to get cups, cups like this. And get notepads and really cool merchandise. Yeah. I got some jackets and some cardigans this week. It's very cool. Now, before anyone oh, says it... Oh, it's a new live visitor. Thank you. Who was it? Jean. Jean. Before um, anybody says it, we are well within compliance to share <laughs> this video. We're allowed. We're allowed to. <laughs> so, if anybody says, um, you're not allowed to share these things. We are. We are. Mm. We have them in our hands. We're allowed to share them. Yes. And we share them because we want people to get these products as well. We want you to join mm. our team and get these products and get any products. You can still get the retired products. There's, can... there's some that feel like, oh, the retired products, then people don't purchase them. We love to focus on the new. I'm all about the new. Actually, and... let's talk about the old for a second. Yes. Um, so in Australia, a lot of the stamp sets mm. are already sold out. Yeah. Um, I wanted to share that video, you know, the one that I made with the, um, the gatefold oh, card. Yeah. I no. wanted to make a video out of that. That oh. stamp set's gone. I picked another two stamp sets that I could use instead. Both those stamp sets are gone. Those things are so, selling things out. Things are selling out. Mm. So if there is something on the retiring list mm. that you would like to purchase, get it now because it's <laughs> going to be sold out. And in Australia, once the stock is mm. gone, it's gone. Mm. Um, in other countries, they still have opportunity to make them and ship them still. But in Australia, once it's gone, mm. it's gone. Mm. And another thing that I really like about new product time or pre-order time is that we can focus on helping people around the world with samples. So we love sharing ideas. And Bruno has made some cards. They're cards that we made in the dark. In the dark. Because we, we had a power outage last night. Good to see you, Kenzie. So we definitely are going to show you some samples today using the new, brand new, in the colours. 
<laughs> I love new colors. I'm very sad about Pretty Peacock going, and I'm very sad about Rococo Rose going Rococo too. Rose. But we have some beautiful new colors. So let's jump in. Shall we get underway? In. Yes, let's jump in. So thank you all very much for being here. We we really appreciate. It. I'm just gonna pop up a link for you all. Do it. Um, so that if you Hi, live sweetie. in Australia and you want any of these products that we're showing you, you can order it in the starter kit. And the starter kit is $169 in Australia, but you pick $235 of anything you want, including any of these new products. Yes. So you get $66 for free. So that's why we like to share this because it is such a good deal. Once you sign up, you get a minimum of 20% off all of your purchases. So if there's things that you know you love, there's things that you know you're going to order, joining is absolutely 100% the best way to go. The best yes. way to save or get more, get more. product yeah. for the money that you're spending. So, yes, show us new stuff. Um, one other thing. If, if you want to add these products to your starter kit, Remember the names that we're showing you. So mm. we'll, we'll, you can we'll write them down. Write down the names, mm. and when you click on that link that Kylie just posted, you can search for those product names, mm. and um, you can add those to your starter kit. You know yeah. you want to do it. Very exciting. And if you have any issues signing up, sometimes <laughs> there's a few technical glitches and things like that. Don't hesitate to reach out to us, and we'll be able to help you with that. Without further ado. <laughs> I'm excited. Um, <laughs> do you know where the... Oh, here. I just thought I'd put them. So, Kylie. Oh, what do we have here, Bruno? This is a colour called... Pale Papaya. Pale Papaya. Are you glad I remember that? Yes, I've I I've been practising. <laughs> pale Papaya. And here's the ink to go with Pale Papaya. And we've got new blends. <gasps> and and ribbon yay I love how Stampin' Up all of this coordinates even markers markers yeah, yeah. it's so good so, so that's what do you think of papaya. papaya um I'm not usually this kind of color girl it's not usually my go-to but I know that it's going to be a very handy combo to colors like yeah, it's something to bring in a little bit of lighter colour. Um, it's very on trend. I mean, the colours that Stampin' Up! always pick are very on trend. Which Let's is meet great. our next one. Who are we meeting now? Who's our next friend? Fresh oh, Freesia. Oh, Fresh Freesia. It's um, reminiscent do, do, of Purple do, do, Crazy. Do, 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 but I feel... Do, do. Is it a little bit... Let's do, let's do a Purple Crazy combo. Is this purple posy here? Yes. So that's the difference. You're not allowed to look at your watch today, Bruno, even if it is notifications. So yeah, you it's can a see bit here, it's darker. Yeah, darker. It's got a different tone to it. Yes, Paula, all five colours. Yeah. And then next to Highland Heather, like it's going to be absolutely stunza with that. Mmm. Gorgeous. But then it's got like a little bit of a pink tinge to it, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, I think it's this? a pink, but, like, yeah. but it's next to this, it's a purple. Yeah, no, I like that. That's very nice. Our next friend. What's our next friend? Is Soft Succulent. Oh, so Can you get a piece of mint macaron? Yeah, and what about a bit of Just Jade as well? Yeah. Now, interesting, um, we've created a graphic... Mm. So, um, I don't know when we'll get this Ooh. out to you. Yeah, very nice. Mint, maca, and this together. And then this is just jade. Ooh, Ooh very nice. Very nice. Yeah, so that, that's definitely a good combo. They've done a, done a good job there researching that. Now, um, as I was mentioning, there is a new a, a graphic that we have created uh, which shows all the five new colours... And the and, and five of both current and retired colors, just That's to see cool. where stamp where these colors fit in the whole Stampin' Up universe. In this, the whole Stampin' Up this universe. This is called polished pink. Polished pink. And that comes in an ink pad. It comes in blends. It comes in uh, ribbon. Hello from Tallahassee. So I think that 
with polished pink. So this is Mambo next Mambo to Mambo. it. So that's a really nice combo, that two, that one. Magi. I don't think... I don't know if Magenta Madness... And is Magenta Madness staying? Yes. Is that, that's the next year. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure if that... Yeah, it's like an 80s could, combo. Yeah, you could combo that, couldn't you? But I love it with the Melon Mambo. I think that's really hot. And the last of the new in colours is called... Evening... Evergreen. Evening evergreen. It's in the evening. So that's garden green. Yeah, nah. And this is shaded spruce. Yeah. Completely different. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. And then there's also mossy. Let's have a look at mossy. Ooh, that combo's nice. Yeah, I can see our trees being done with that. That's a really nice combo. Yeah. So these, this is available in ink pad, um, ribbon, in blends, light and dark. Yeah. Um, and here is the five oh. colors all together. Oh dear. One, two, three. <laughs> oh dear. Sorry, everyone. That's all right. We don't mind. We're enjoying all your company. Ooh. Oh, pretty. Yeah, that's a really nice combo. Probably I'll use those four together. Definitely for a really like I can see an ice cream card made of that. Do we still have ice cream in the new catalog? But even these two together. Yeah, those two as a combo would be good too. The two greens. The greens, yeah, they go really well together. Yeah, so they're very nice. Yeah, I like them. They These feel are the, very the five spring. ribbons all together. Yeah. Very nice. These are... Now, they're not supposed to be in upright like that, but I just put them in there so that they would keep them together. Now, do you have a system, Bruno? I know you love your processes. Just put it over there. Really? Yeah. <gasps> I'm so excited. But not in the box. No. Yeah. Not in the box. These are the five colours. We haven't put the stickers on yet. Yeah, the new colours are really good. So do you have um, anything, any samples to show us how nice um, the colours are? I'm still going made? with some other things on um, in colours. On in colours, okay, yeah. good. Thank, Thank you. you. So, also with in colours are these coloured jewels. Ooh. So I'll take it out of the packet there and you'll see that they come in each of the colours. I'd love to see them used, what they'd look like. Well, good thing that we have something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love the sheer ribbons too. <laughs> now, if you live in Australia, we ha are running a an in colour. <laughs> Dan Murphy's is having a sale. <laughs> Yay! Three days only. Thanks, Dan. Dan Murphy's a, is an alcohol <laughs> shop in Australia. <laughs> um, we're going to be having an in colour club. Mm. So you can collect over five months all of these products. And so the colour, um, the cost is spread over. Um, five months. So make sure you sign up to our newsletter, particularly yeah. if you live in Australia. Anyone can sign up because um, I've got some exciting training coming up too. So make sure you sign up and um, yeah, we'll let you know about the club. We'll probably have a paper club as well. Yes, there'll be a paper club. Yeah. Um, we'll wait until we're able to order mm. everything. But we'll give you so some details. These are the six by six color stack. There's different colours on both sides, and there's two different designs in mm. each colour. And this is also used on the project. So we're Ooh, going to today. you did well. You almost used every bit of the in colours. That's right. There Thank we are. You. Thank you. And the last thing, we haven't even looked at this. Mm. So this is in colour shimmer velum. Velum. We know that Bruno loves his velum. Love myself a velum. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be wow! Exciting. It's like, can you see the shimmer? Uh, where, where's the light? Yeah, oh, you yeah, can sort of see the bit. light. And maybe, there's... maybe down below. Can you see it on here? Oh yeah, a little bit more. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. You can see that. Yeah. Ooh, and you can essence. see that it's. Like it's translucent, mm. you can see. 
And so you get two sheets in each color. There's the, um, that must be the soft succulent. That's the pinky pink, <laughs> polished pink. Polished pink. <laughs> this is evening evergreen. Wow. Fresh freeze. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's cool. It's going to be fun using that. And pale papaya. Whoa. Yeah, you can see that it's translucent like that's that. That's really cool. I love having new things. Vellum! Vellum! <laughs> and no, it's not how we say no. vellum in Australia. It's just, just a funny joke. <laughs> oh, that phone has notifications That's on. That's alright, I can turn them off. Is it, <laughs> is it annoying you? <laughs> it's gonna be... There's an Australia Post delivery coming today. There is! I love getting my notifications. I've turned them off for you. Thank you, my love. Thank you. Now, would you like to see some samples? <gasps> oh, yes, please. So, um, a bit of our coffee. this is using some products that we haven't had a look at yet. Right. Um, so, is the down... Oh, no, it's just front. Yeah. So, this is the project. Ooh -hoo -hoo. So, this is using the designer series paper that we had just had a look at. It's a six by six. This is just the cardstock. Uh, this is a stamp that we're going to look at called... Pansy? Yes. Pansy Patch. Mm. And this is the coordinating dies that go with that. And yes, that's right, Smriti. The vellum has two colours. Two sheets two in each colour. Two sheets of each colour. Yeah, 12 by 12. So, um, yeah, I'll just zoom into that die. Mm. So there's lots of little pieces. I only used a few of them, and that was fun. And, and of do course, you see it's the not little a run. Oh, and the little nudie run. <laughs> yeah, the little diamond. The little diamond. What are they called? Um, Iridescent. <laughs> no. Jewels. Any color, color jewels. jewels. Hmm. So I made one in fresh freezer. Fresh freezer. One in Evening Evergreen. evergreen. Ooh, I like the Evening Evergreen. Which Soft one's your favourite? <gasps> that's nice. Um, sorry. Um, polished Pink. Polished Pink. And Pale Papaya. <gasps> they look fantastic. What a combo. You did a really good job on those. And how did you get that layout? Such a nice layout. Um, did anything help you? The catalogue, maybe? He means the card templates. <laughs> oh, the outside. I thought you were yeah. pointing to that. <laughs> no. No. Yeah, that's a card template. This is a um, mm -hmm. Bermuda Bay and... Coastal Cabana, Coastal I think. Coastal Cabana. I think, that's, I think. A good, that's a good combo, that one. If you don't know what our card templates are, um, then you can have a look at this link here. But they help you with your layers. Like, I did initially, I didn't think that these colours necessarily mm. looked good together but no, they do. all five together I mm. think look look really neat yeah really nice so um, we will post we'll take pictures of these and post them literally we made them in candlelight last night <laughs> the because power we had, was off. <laughs> had no power so that's fun <laughs> and I was trying to do, cut the pale papaya sentiment I think I chopped it in half like three times I, couldn't, couldn't cook, I can't see, see when there's light let alone no light Yes, we did love it. Top it already. Bit of licky. Yeah. They're <laughs> six by sixes, so it's a bit different to the um, big 12 one. 12 by 12, but yeah, but, we still yeah. used up our designer series paper. Now, who wants to see some more? <laughs> yes, please. So we're going to look at the Simply Elegant Suite. Now. Ooh. I'll show, you, I'll show you facing downwards. So. Oops, that. And then that, yeah. There we go. There we are. So this is a stamp set. It's a rubber stamp set. Mm -hmm. um, have you stamped using this yet, Kylie? I have not. No. I haven't got to play with any of the stamps yet, so that will happen. I did. I know. Before me. Yes. So that coordinates with a punch called the Elegant Tag Punch. Ooh. Now. I'm, I'm sure you're wondering, what does that look like actually cut out? Yeah, I do want to know what that well, looks like. Well, look at this. Ah, thanks, Bruno. In each of the colours. <laughs> that looks really good. That'll be good for the sentiments. 
Would you have them facing up like that? So it's like a shield or facing down like or that? down, yeah. I don't know. I We will have a play. I um I can't even remember what it looked like in, in the, the catalog. catalog. Mm. So that also That's coordinates with some elegant trim. Ooh. Now this is like um it's not like the the fine trim that we used to have. It's like a, a cord. And so that comes in a pack of two. I think they used to be in a kit or something. Something, yes. Mm, yes, that very sounds nice. very familiar. Now, look at this. I'm going to throw that in the bin. <gasps> You're a rebel without a cause. Rebel without a cause. <laughs> and the last thing in this suite is some Yee! paper. I can't wait for new paper. It looks like it's specialty as well. If you struggle with chopping your paper and you hoard it, come and join our Love It Chop It workshop that's free. Oh dear, this is... It's going to be hard to chop this paper, I'm telling you. Wow. <laughs> We're going to need help. <laughs> There's going to be an intervention. Oh! <laughs> oh! I love that one. Wow. It's so Art Deco. Now, can you see those all? Yes. Everybody? See. Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay, so that's the wow. the shimmery side. This one is definitely my favourite. Yeah, that one's gorgeous. What era is that, Bruno, in architecture? In the 20s, I would 20s, say. It's beautiful. Very nice stamping up. I think I'm going to just use this side, but we shall see Let's what the other side looks like. Let's have a look what the other looks side like. looks like. <gasps> Here we go. Oh, how do I do <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Whoops. Ooh. Oh, I was not expecting oh. that. Exciting. Wow. Can you see That's all That's very of those? nice. Yep. So yeah. this is more of like a um, monochrome. They're very masculine. Very nice. Aren't they? They're very nice. Like I could this see... one? Like this? I, the, I like them all. The this would be good stay? as a shirt. Yeah. The um, suit and tie. Well suited. Yeah, yeah. well suited. <laughs> sweeted. Sweeted. He loves that. It's like your velum. <laughs> well sweeted in my velum. But yeah, I could see even this one used as well oh that paper's not available in the u.s oh sorry Debs. you got a lot to look forward to because it is stunning yeah this oh. honestly this other this is great this is beautiful this yes. is this in itself would be a beautiful um lot of paper lot of paper yeah, but, but this, this side like, whoa this page here <laughs> <laughs> this paint, yeah. Wow. Well, I mean, all of them are beautiful, but yeah. But that's a standout. That's a definite yeah. standout. Yeah. Very nice. There used to be something. Similar. Bruno's feeling inspired. I can see it in his face. He's like, I want to chop it today. No, I don't. <laughs> Why not? Why do you want to chop it today? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> so that is the simply elegant sweet. Yes. Um, if you. If you are wanting to add that to your starter kit, you can add it as one order. So if you just search for Simply Elegant Suite, mm -hmm. or you could buy it as a bundle just with the stamp set and the punch, mm. or you can buy them all individually, I think. Yes, because there's product numbers. Mm. So, so how much it. is the suite? The suite is $102.75. Oh, so you have plenty left over. Yep. Yeah, you could, you'd still have like another hundred and thirty You could buy $30 that spend. suite... Yeah. And the next suite that we're going to Whoa, show you. So you could buy two suites and only pay $169. Is it copper or gold foil? It's both, Charlotte. Yes. Copper and gold. Yes. Um, really, really doesn't say, beautiful. sorry. I'm sure it does in the catalogue. Yeah. If you have a copy of the catalogue, sure you can... i on the back here, in fact. Um, basic... I can't read. Basic black, basic grey, very vanilla, whisper white. Yeah, it doesn't say the... doesn't really say. But, yes, it definitely looks bronze. That looks bronze. That and looks bronze, but and the other one looks... Or a copper. Oh, it looks bronze and gold. Gold, yeah. yeah. And is that silver as well? Yeah. Yep. So I think Bronze, it's gold, three. silver. Again, bronze, bronze gold, gold, silver. Yeah. That one's definitely gold. Yeah. Can you see all that? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's gold. Gold. Silver. Gold and silk. Gold. Yeah. yeah. Gorgeous. Really pretty. Ah, I'm in love. And by the way, if you chop one pack of designer series paper, 12 by 12 paper, 
you will get 72 full card fronts and they do fit in our clear cases like you can buy these clear mount cases i'll show the back you can buy these cases in a pack of four for ten dollars in australia and one whole pack of designer series paper will fit into one of these cases which is a great way for storage and it'll make sure that you use it too if it's in the card front <laughs> size then it's much better i'm just reading caitlin reading. Um, I love the Stampin' Up! DSP. There are so many patterns I would love to get in fabric and have mm. clothes made out of them. Yes. yes. Beautiful. Yeah, like one of those, I'm like, oh, I'd have a shirt in that. But you can make a shirt in there using that well-suited, yeah. suited. <laughs> <laughs> so the next suite we're going to look at is called Pansy Petals. Yes, I like Paula. We give you permission after you chop your first pack to buy another pack <laughs> or just buy two so that then you can chop one <laughs> so this is the stamp set and this is the um, one that i used on this card okay so this sentiment is taken from this stamp set mm -hmm. little hello from me to you oh cute uh -huh. so this is a um oh this is a photopolymer stamp set and as you may know, this mm. is the way that the stamps will be delivered now with the image on um, the inside case. And the idea is that you can stick it down like that mm. to the inside of the case. Some have had success with that, some not so much. So I'll I don't know what, will, will we just keep it in those, do you think? Um, not sure. Mm. We have tried that before. Mm. Um, Anyway, we'll it's, see. We'll when, give it, it a go. when it gets a little bit stiff, because sometimes they get a bit stiff, just refresh it with your um, the mist, yeah, or even just a spritz of water actually, because I think the mist can break down the polymer. That's why they've got the the chamois now. Chamois. Yeah. So just water, just spritz it with water, and it'll refresh it so it's not stiff. So, um, just looking at this stamp set, it has some nice sentiments across the top here. Mm. These ones here are two-step stamping. Mm -hmm. So, um, you can either do it in the same colour just to get a bit of vibrancy in various parts, or you can do it in some complementary colours or even mm. contrasting colours. You could do that. So, they go together, they go together, they go together, they go together, they go together. Um, and wouldn't it be really good if there were some dyes that went along with that? I would like that. Well, you know what? There is. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> so some of these dyes are designed to cut out, um, like, for example, this one here. You can see that. Mm. Yep. Is designed to cut this flower out. Mm. Some of them are designed to just be accent pieces that go with the stamp set. Mm. And some of them actually coordinate with... Some designer series paper. You had me at paper. <laughs> so Yeah, I love the sentiments too, Smitty. They're beautiful. And you know, interesting, um, stamping sentiment this sentiment, it's beautiful to stamp. Mm. It's just the right um, thickness. Mm. Um, and it we didn't do a dud stamp at all. Really in good. all the pieces. Mm. We had to cut um, as Kylie mentioned. I did dud cuts. Dud cuts, but, but not, not dud, dud stamping. <laughs> <laughs> so what do we have in here we have 12 sheets as normal Ooh, this is looking good yay two of those i think this is an ode to the in colors are these two of those the in colors plus got, others got blackberry bliss there as well from the looks of it five and six. Ooh. so you can see all those i'm feeling very spring summer this one's really cute Reminds me of like a 60s retro wallpaper. Yeah. And this is cute. I like that. Very nice. Mm. I like it with the soft sea foam in the background. I wouldn't use that. And then, whoops, have to take it out of the pack. <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! Bruno's wearing the top. <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> wow. Which shirt are you wearing, Bruno? <laughs> I did not expect no, that. Yeah, that's really cool. Can see all of those. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's one the, more yellow. Yeah, there we go. That's really cool. So yeah, they um wow, this green one is beautiful. Yeah. I can Again, see you doing a shirt out a jacket out of that. I think one. all of these <laughs> would be perfect uh, using the well sweet suited sweet. 
<laughs> he always calls it the well suited suit. <laughs> this is English. It's the same spelling. <laughs> what was the other word that you realised the other way? When we have inclinations and we're inclined, like yes. an incline and an inclined. <laughs> it's like what? It's the same word. Now, which one? I think it's this one that cuts. Ooh, really? It cuts it. Um, That's a bit special. I think it's that one. Yes, I think you're right. Yes. It's <gasps> a bit. Can you cool. see that? Yes, you can see it on there. So I love it those. when the designer series paper matches the dies. And I'm pretty sure this one does as well. See you, Miss Jenka. Yes. Oh, uh, is that? Yes. <laughs> so that's two of them. That's great. And I'm sure these leaves cut out. Ooh, I love it. Yes. Yay. That's so cool. That's really cool. Now I'm going to have to put these. <laughs> P.S. With the dies, <laughs> just take a photo of your dies. Let's hold it over here. Take a photo of your dies before you undo it because we always do it. We're like, oh, I should have taken a photo. So, yes, just have a visual so that you don't have to play Tetris. Although Bruno plays that game for fun, so... Just consider this fun. It's not fun because I never... <laughs> I can never line it up again. <laughs> okay, I think that's it. I think you've worked it out. <laughs> Is there another piece there? No. No, it's just the oh, Look at all that leftover space. <laughs> I'll put that away for you. Thank you, my love. <laughs> so, is there anything else in this suite? Yes, there is. Ooh. There are some bumblebee trinkets. That's cute. So, there used to be something like this in the botanical. Was it in the Burr Indigo suite? No, it was botanical. Oh, botanical, yeah. that's right. <laughs> As I just <laughs> said. <laughs> I didn't remember botanical. <laughs> um, but they're really cute. I should have used that on. Yeah, they're cute. Oh, I like your I like your little dot your um rhinestones. Yep. I think they look really the jewels. I think if, if you put your little bumblebee, oh, you put. Oh, you're away, welcome, it'd Jacqueline. It'd be a bit too much, I think. Jacqueline just thanked us for a card we sent. Oh, nice. So let's just move on to. Something well, that else. That was fun. The pansy patch. Yes. Sweet was fun. So if you wanted to, you could get the pansy patch and the other elegant one. <laughs> I love Bruno's turning into a rebel. He took the paper off. It's so exciting. So the next one we are going to look at is called Beauty of the Earth. Ooh. I scan my dies on the sheet. They come. That would be. Scanning is clever. That would be very smart. Yeah. Scanning is very clever, Joe. I love it. And then yeah. you could just put a copy of the image inside with your dies. <laughs> yeah. I have a confession about this stamp set. Yes. When I first saw this in the catalogue, I What's was a bit. What's she saying? You're like, what ifs? Um, this is when I looked at it in the PDF. Now, excuse me, just burped. Sorry, That's everyone. That's okay. I forgive you. It's an exciting time. <laughs> Burping occurs when we're excited. <laughs> um, so, the, yeah, you weren't impressed. Well, it wasn't really but impressed. What but you? then I saw it in the paper catalogue. And, mm. and this is very cool because isn't it, isn't it using that one? Pretty much. Oh, it's very that. similar. Yeah, it's the other one, I think, maybe. But, yeah, very similar. So this is a photopolymer stamp set. It's quite a big, uh, mm. quite a lot of stamps in there. Is it larger than the outside image? Does it say images at 50% down the bottom there? I can't read. Images maybe. at 90, 90%. 90%. Mm. So this is two-step stamping. So mm. they go together, they go together. Um, mm. That probably goes with that. That's cool. And I love the... Vicky Allenson. Oh, Vicky. We love you. Heart. <laughs> oh, that's cute. So, um, wouldn't it be nice if there was some dyes that go along with this? Yeah, I'd like that. Well, you know what? There is. <gasps> what? Look at these. Ooh, they're a bit exciting. So, they can cut out the stamped image. Yeah. As well as other... Um, elements. This it. one here would be um, 
this will cut out the outside of the foliage mm. and this would come out cut out the inside that would of look the foliage. Amazing, that that would look very nice. Yeah. The sentiments that go with it. Thank you. Friendships refresh the soul. You truly inspire me. It's reminiscent. Do you remember that special stamp set that we got? That was beautiful branches. Yeah, yeah. it reminds me of that. I love it. That was one of it my seems favorites. a lot bigger. Yes. And the tree shape is a bit different. Mm. So. And there's a splatter. There's a splatter. You can always a use a splatter. <laughs> now, out of interest, this one here. It looks. Like it looks it's... like there's um, two different shades on it, mm. so it must be. Um, distinctive distinctive it doesn't doesn't say, say it, it but mm. yeah there must be something to do with that now wouldn't it be nice if there was an embossing folder oh, really that looks like tree folder um i want yeah. a bark embossing folder well you know what here is a 3d <laughs> embossing folder Whoa, that, i'm gonna use this a lot this one this now, is you hot. can see that this is very similar but different it reminds me of mm. the glass in our front door in my childhood home. Really? Yeah. Was it like a orange. yellow? It was orange. orange. Yeah. And it was, it looked exactly like that, and you couldn't <laughs> see through it. Yeah. But um, this has been very popular. This type of um, embossing folder has been very popular in recent catalogues. Mm. You might remember the paint one mm. that looks like it's I love paint that one. that's been. Mm. There's also Art the um, the. Uh, um, paper you know the um old paper oh yes yes old world yep yeah yep that's very nice that one yeah but really anyway like this would be very popular mm. um now wouldn't it be nice if there was some paper <laughs> we always love paper give me Paper. Here is some ah. paper. Love me some paper. <laughs> oh, Honeybee Stamping Hive just retracted a message. Aww. I missed it. She'll put it up again. She probably had a spelling error in there. I do that. I like things. Whoa. To wow. That's nice. Whoa. Ooh, I like that one. They're my colours. I love awesome colours. Nice. Yes. Old world. Yeah, that's it. Yes, use the vellum with the bark folder. That Lena looks. still has so that good. on her front door. Yeah. You still have it, Lena. That's My parents hilarious. still have it on their front door, yeah. too. Ooh. Ooh. And this one here, people, I get really excited that Stampin' Up! are doing this because this is exactly Love It, Chop It. Like, this is exactly how we cut our paper, which is in half and then in three card fronts. So it's like Stampin' Up! watch love it chop it because <laughs> actually there is a secret sarah is in that group <laughs> she asked to be in it and a few of the design team too because they wanted to learn how we use our paper and i'm so excited because this to me feels like they're really truly listening to how we use our there's paper. there's been a few that have been like that yes. like in the um, yeah, last ranges. couple of ca catalogs they've done it like that but, you know, you might look at it and go, how does that work for a 12 by 12? Half, half, half. But it really genuinely yeah, is designed for card making people. You could still use it as a 12 by 12, but that, yeah. The dies cut out the and trees on the that. paper. Very interesting. I love that paper. All right. Yes, I'm not turning it over yet. So then we have that. I'm and, tempted to. And then the last one is this one. Usually it's... A strong pattern one side and soft on the other. What do you think, Brenna? Do you think it's going to be softer on the other side? Because that's usually how they work. No. You don't think it'll be softer? Ooh! Ooh. I didn't expect this side. This one is beautiful. Oh. Look at this. Wow. These blues are great. Oh, this wood one is beautiful. Yes. So you could use this. <laughs> you could double this. You could mm. run that through like that. Mm. Wow, that's beautiful. Really pretty. Look at that combo of those two. Excellent. Now, I wonder Use which that for trees... sea or even sky. So someone said that the trees cut out. So you could probably just do... Ah, uh, there was lots of things that were not available in the pre-order in the US. Aw, sorry everyone. Sorry. We stole all your stuff. Oops. Trying to see if there was one... three things that didn't come for us as well. 
Yeah, I think it's just that you can use this. Oh, that, yeah. On, like, say, this on paper that. here. Right. And, it looks and like then it's going to look like a tree. Yeah. So it'll look like the bushes sort of thing of the tree. Which is very cool. I like that idea. And that's all of that. Well done. And I like that there's a sentiment die. I always love yes. these type sentiment type dies on the um, in the frames and the dies. I can never get too many of them. Beautiful. So that Thank is that you. bundle. Let me that put that away. That goes into there. Yes. That goes into nothing. Nice. The next one we're going to look at is called. P.S. Just to see, so you can, I can show you this. When I'm putting this away, I put the um, little blurb here, and that goes at the back here, so I can see. And it's a lot easier for me to close my little thing if I have it this way. If you have the dies the other way, it gets caught. caught yeah. So, just but a also, bit. like in the next few days, we'll add a label on this mm. just because that text is a it's bit too small. <laughs> and Kylie can't read anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Kylie's going blind. <laughs> So the that's final the tip. suite that we're going to look at is called Hand Penned. Ooh. So this has um, everything okay? Yep, just doing a tidy tidy. Excellent. So this is the stamp set. Oh, very pretty. I like that font. The font is very nice. Wow. Thanks. Anything is possible. Ooh, congratulations. congratulations. This is great. Feel better, friend. Oh, thanks. So, like do you think this is double stamping? Yeah, two-step stamping. So, it looks like these mm, can go in section? there. Yeah. These can go on to there. Mm. I um, think these are these ones. And that one is like... Well, what's that one? This one here can go in yeah. there. Yeah, I'm not that, sure. I think that one might be that one, but mm, maybe not. But anyway, that is a also mm. a photo of Palmer. Mm. Do you like my accent? <laughs> nice. I really like that. That's I love those sentiments. That congratulations is going to be <coughs> very handy. And I think that that congratulations would go perfectly with the die and the tree. To be honest. Ooh. I think that that would be a perfect match. What do you reckon? What do you got? And you what got you could do, match. what you could do is, um, no, it's actually a pretty good size. But if you just chop it a little bit more, you can come back in again, and then that it's perfect there. And even that one, does that fit? Oh no, it's a little bit too big. Yeah, that's handy. Handy to know. <clears throat> I like working out all my dies. So there are some on oh, this. That's beautiful. There are some. Dies, wow. a die collection. The dies is called penned flowers dies. Um, you can cut out these images using mm. these outside pieces. There's a, a border piece here. Nice. Uh, there's also another accent piece. Mm. So um, it's a really detailed one. Very too. detailed this mm. one. Uh, this would cut out uh, this piece mm. here, but also similar to what the hydrangeas did. You know how it cut out a little. Oh, yes, like little a little bits. scallop, yeah. Mm. Um, yeah, so these will go really nice together. Mm. Also in this suite... Oh, dear, did you just see that update? What was that update? <laughs> Something's happening in the zoo in in Sydney. Oh, no. Um, There's drama every day these days. Drama, drama, drama. This is called Genial Gems. Now, I think they might be the two new ink colours, succulent mm -hmm. and papaya. And they are like... They're a bit sparkly. A bit sparkly. <laughs> Very pretty. Now, what would a sweet be... <gasps> Without paper! Without paper. <laughs> I love paper. <laughs> I'm addicted Woo! to new designer series paper. Okay. You haven't sang for us today, Bruno. Is there any songs that oh, you thought Oh, wow. Of? Look at that. <gasps> That's very pretty. Beautiful penmanship. And this can give you a good idea of what colours to stamp the, mm. the um, images in. Oh, wow. That's great. It reminds me of illustrations in mm. a children's book. Or fi Fine Bone China. Fine Bone China. Mm. 
Here's another I one. Put the little light on for you. Sorry. Yeah, it is a bit dark. Yeah, so slow. Ah, oh, that's better. Sorry, everyone. Blinded by the light. That's really pretty. Very beautiful art, um, ink work. That's the last one. That's a beautiful one. Mm. Really like that one. Love the different coloring. Hmm. So it's very similar in the style, mm, just different, different colors. colors. Mm. And then let's turn it over. What? I love it. So this must be pale papaya, soft succulent. Mm, I think that might be blushing. What does it say on the back of your paper? It is basic black blushing bride cinnamon cider. Oh, yeah, that was in there. Daffodil Delight, Garden Green, Highland Heather, Mint Macaron. Oh, it's Mint Macaron. Misty Moonlight, Pale Papaya, Pool Party, Whisper Light. Oh, it's a good combo. Nice one, Stampin' Up. Very nice. pretty. Oh, I so like that. So this will be a very nice... Um, mm. Sweet. <laughs> sweet. And I really, really have to apologise that I didn't do the inserts for the last catalogue. I promise I'll do it for this one. Because I know how much you love your inserts and you're all very patient with me. No one complains. The outline die will cut out the DSP. Beautiful. Oh, good to know. <clears throat> now, we next have four bundles that we're going to share with you. Four bundles? Two That's a bit exciting. Time. The first one is called um, Colour and Contour Bundle. Nice. So again, there's some two-step, sorry. All right. Some two-step stamping there. There we go. It's a little bit better. Um, we've got a daisy. A daisy. Bruno loves daisies. This is, this is, a, this is better. Bruno's daisy. Did you turn that off? I did. It was a little bit. It's better that way. Okay. So this, um, I really like this daisy. Mm. It's more. Yeah. Yeah. It's more modern. You're absolutely amazing. You are amazing. Yeah. Um, here for you now. Thank you for everything. So very happy for you. Good sentiments. Now this dies is called. Can you read that? Scalloped Contours dies. No, I can't read that. <laughs> this is very interesting, this one, this one, because it's a bundle, but they don't really go to... Well, they do. <gasps> wow. So you can see these pieces cut out these and these cut out these. Yeah, but, but these, these ones here, handy. they're more like... Um, I don't know what you'd call them. Frames. Now, let's have a look. Oh, will they fit for Australian size? They usually don't. So we'll forgive Stampin' Up. Oh, They're a little bit better than usual. I would cope with that. Yeah, I would cope with that too. I really like that. Mm. Yeah. That's very nice. Yeah, I really like that. Thank you, Stampin' Up. And yes, I love the Splatter 2, Paula. There's also this Carrie one here. Carrie loves the dyes. Oh, I'm glad you're having fun, Laurie. This has, um, it's a sham, um, not a chamfer, a, what's that called? That shape? Scallop. Scallop. <laughs> but it also has some stitching on it. Mm. And so some of these have... They've got like different patterns yeah, on it, Yeah, they're different they? patterns. One is a scallop with a bit cut out. Mm. The next one is a scallop with some dots. Mm. The next one is some a scallop with some Stitch. dashed line. Mm. The next one is a scallop with a design. The next one is a scallop with some dots. So yeah, I'll be interested mm. to see what people come up with. Mm. And of course, they nest within one another, so you can do um, layer, up and layer, up and layer, <laughs> like a Sara Lee cheesecake. <laughs> so that is the color and contour bundle. I like that bundle. Thank you, Paula. Yes, you told me it was scallop. Scallop, yes, scallop. Scallop Saint Jacques. Scallop Saint Jacques. <laughs> this is the inspired thoughts bundle. I really like these sentiments. Oh, you got a bit of my hair in there. So this Sorry. has 
Um, this is a red rubber stamp and that has some nice inspiring thoughts. Can Congrats. I just can I just send a message to Stampin' Up? If they're sentiments, please make them polymer. <laughs> I want to be able to see through them. <laughs> I don't mind images being um, Hi, Kathy. red rubber, but I, Hi, love, I love my sentiments and polymer. Um, I just very love seeing nice. through. Yeah. But um, I'll still use these because I'm going to use these. These are going to be my new favourite, this one. This is a beautiful font and I like how they um, they mm. go together. This with heartfelt sympathy is, mm. is beautiful. Yeah. So what do the dyes look like on this? Yes. Show Again, us, Bruno. Like, what would you think that the dyes look like on this? Maybe some sentiment type dyes. Yeah, some squares some and squares, some things. Yeah. You're going to surprise us. I'm not going to surprise you. Stampin' Up's going to surprise Stampin' Up's going to surprise us. <laughs> Here we go. What? <laughs> <laughs> my in my head. What? What even? <laughs> That's actually really funny. Isn't it? <laughs> I really like it. They're but, beautiful. But it's not what I expected at all. Interesting, this die, <laughs> like you could use it on a portrait card mm. but it's basically designed for a landscape card mm. which is nice yeah there's another one of these um like mountains, mountains. like mm. hills and things like that mm. some foliage that can go um so while these are sold as a bundle mm. they don't necessarily need to go with each other no um they could be separate entities I'm not sure in the pre-order whether whether you can buy them by themselves. Mm. So um, just keep that in mind. Uh, you might have to buy them both. But um, yeah, if you're making a sympathy card, mm. this would go very nice. Yeah, very nice. Very yeah. simple, um, elegant. Mm. Yeah. But anyway, that was very interesting. <laughs> Randy said, random die. <laughs> <laughs> Kerry, more trees, yay. <laughs> Uh, you you preempted that well. You got you got the best <laughs> the best reaction the best bang for your buck. <laughs> the last two. So I think you're gonna really gonna like this one. This is called the Flowers of Friendship. Ooh, I do like that stamp set, one. and it comes with a punch. Ooh, that's very sweet. So this again has some very similar line work to that. Um, mm. The paper that we saw from the hand penned bundle. Mm. You can see that. Oh, yeah. So it has a flower, some other flowers. Again, some beautiful fonts. Thank you, mm. Stampin' Up. Yeah, the, the fonts the are fonts amazing. The fonts are really good. Yeah. This one here, many thanks from all of us. That's mm. a beautiful mm. little, thank, little card, big thanks. Life is better with friends like you. Thank you for everything. So this is a... A builder stamp. Mm -hmm. This is called the Flowers and Leaves Punch because there's flowers and leaves. <laughs> now, would you like to see what it looks like after it's been punched? Yes, please. Here's some I prepared earlier. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> so, any of these could be used by themselves. They could be used, you can add a few extra petals to them. Oh, that's cute. Um, yeah, but I they like do look them. good. But these flowers also, they line up with the stamped mm. image, or whichever way you do it. Mm. You'll just have to stamp it and then line it up on mm. the inside. Uh, there's a smaller flower there. And of course, there's the leaves. The leaves. And there's a small leaf here. Mm. I like that. But I have a feeling that this will be very popular. Mm. Um, lots that you could do with this. You could colour it with blends. Mm. And, um, yeah. You can make that as a background. These as yes. a background. Yeah. Yeah, those or are the background individual. just with the sentiment and the yeah. piece. It's got a lot of variety to it. Mm. Linda likes the fonts as well. Deborah Davidson, gotta love a good punch. Yes. I agree, Deborah. We love a punch. Punches are fun. 
And the last bundle that we have, oh, I think this is going to be very popular too. This Ooh, is called Quiet, Quiet Meadow. Meadow. And it has some really nice um, line work there. Mm, it's very pretty. There's some... Yeah, I don't know if you can see that, but it's like... Old type. Yeah, thing. it's not... Like news. It's not a sentiment. It's like supposed to be background. repetitive stamping mm. in the background mm. and again this is a red rubber stamp mm. it's good for vin vintage type cards that sort of thing in the background another yeah. ink splatter there for you kylie yes please love me an ink splatter <laughs> thinking of you you're too kind love love heartfelt love and caring thoughts are with you and another daisy um, daisy flower of some mm. sort a tire swing what did I miss of the tire swing? Oh, yeah, on that those trees. Mm. Yes, because I did see the circle and thought, what would that be used for? But that's true. Now, Kylie, what um, dyes <laughs> would you expect <laughs> that go with I this? I have no idea now. <laughs> no, these actually go with them. Oh, do so, they? Oh, that's beautiful. So there's some... Um, oh, that's really pretty. Now, it doesn't appear that any of these stamps... Any of these dies cut out yeah. the stamps, but they're complementary in design mm. and, and shape and things like that. This one's beautiful, this yeah, really um, nice sentiment, sentiment piece. It reminds me of something that used to be in the... Remember the sewing one mm. from a couple of catalogues ago? There yeah. was something very similar to that. Yeah. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six different sprigs. Mm. Um, That's beautiful. Now, I'm imagining... You know, maybe in vellum or mm. in just colour on colour, the same colour. Yeah. And using all of them. And so it's just like a... Mm. Yeah. And even using that designer series paper would be nice with that, the tree one. Yeah. Because then you'd have all those, yeah, patterns and colours. Yeah, it's very nice. Yeah, this would be... Like, that would be quite a bit of cardstock there. So yeah. I'm not sure how... Yeah. Anyway, what I'm it, excited. What does it show in the catalogue? For that be interested to see what do you it have looks a like. um, somewhere where did i put him <laughs> i think he's over here I yeah put, there he is i put a label on it you put a label on yours and yours too <laughs> at the back we're allowed to show the front cover aren't we oh jasper bella must have heard someone here we're allowed to show the cover aren't we yes <gasps> down dun, dun, dun. oh we'll do it down there we go we didn't even show you the front cover how beautiful is that isn't that stanza? Stanza. Stanza. So what page is this set So this on? is the Quiet Meadow. Um, Does it say what page it's on? It does not. It does not. You anyway, can look I'll on have the a back look. In the index. Oh, yeah, true. A Quiet Meadow. So while Kylie's looking that up, what we have next is bits and pieces. So these didn't come in a bundle. These just came by themselves. Oi! <laughs> <laughs> so the next one that we have is a stamp set. And that oh, is called... they sponged it. Like coloured it. Oh, yeah. Interesting. Mm. Yep. And a lot of them are in vellum or in white cut out. Mm. So this one is called Spiral Dye. Mm -hmm. This again is a red rubber. And I want to have a go at mm. this. Um, making a t-shirt. Yeah. What does it remind you of, Renu? Tie dye. Mm. Did you used to have those... Hyper color. <laughs> yeah, but mine wasn't mine wasn't tie dye. It oh, was, was it? yeah. I had a tie dye t shirt <laughs> and then I had hyper color t shirts as well. <laughs> Hi Angie, Hi. Angela. Thanks for joining us today. <laughs> so that's one. Uh, the next one that we have is some card collection. Ooh, I like what you said, Cherie, putting them in a silhouette with black. Yeah, very nice. I like that. And yes, it was a butterfly Linda. <laughs> Weeds are just flowers that are growing where you don't want them. <laughs> so, can we just have the scissors, please? Yes, you may. This light stage. <laughs> so, these are three memories and more 
collections that we have. So this is a set of cards and envelopes. Wow, these are nice. So that's the envelope. So this would go with the... Oh, shut that door. Sorry, there's, everyone. There's a visitor here, clearly. There's a delivery. <laughs> so these are quite large, actually. So this is a Ooh. set of envelopes and card bases. Boy, there's a lot in here. Yeah. So they would just go like that. If you've never got the memories and more, we can highly recommend them because they just have so much value. And they're just great. If you need a card like in a flash and you're sort of losing your mojo, then it's perfect for that. So with this, you can get these envelopes. Um, it's It goes with that. So if you have the stamp set, you can just stamp it on a piece of and just stick it down and, and then you've got a card. Simple, quick, easy. Mm. And there's lots in here. Mm. How many? How many? 20. Wow. So that's 20 in there. And what are these? Are these card bases, are they? Yeah. So do these go with uh, these bases? No. Oh. They go with the hand penned that. Ah, oh. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. So you could use the paper. I'm surprised it didn't come together in the bundle, but anyway. Yeah. How heavy the card bases? They feel like they're a bit. It's almost like thick whisper white. Oh yeah. It's probably yeah, not thick yeah. whisper white, but it's it that thick. sort of. It's yeah. not the same thinness of mm. our normal whisper white. Yeah. Or basic white now. Basic white. Whoops. It's gonna take me a while to remember that. Now, do they all come together? Yep. That were all in one pack. Oh. Hmm. So this one is called What a Year. What a year. Oh, that's good for 2020 and 2021. Oh, what a year. <laughs> so these are um, cards and things that Aww. you can use for memory keeping. There's some albums and things that are available. Mm. But how cute. Sometimes also you can also just stick that on the front of a card mm. and put a sentiment on it. Mm. And that's stamping without stamping. Because mm. <laughs> do they still have... Oh, I should have... But there are still what? albums, yes. No, and the um, card bases for Memories and More. Yes, there yeah. are. Yep. Good. Hi you there. Just that would be top. perfect. Mm. Stick that on a Memories and More note card. There's different size note cards. So mm. there's the small size note card. There's the mm. large size note card. Mm. But there's also the just note cards, mm. which is a... Like an in-between card. Mm. So that would be cool. Yeah, they're very fun. Here are some stickers. So that could be for journaling. Journaling, memory mm. keeping, that sort of thing. Mm. Lots of There's these fun in there. Designs. Fun designs. Mm. Yes, great for scra scrapbooking yeah, pages. Scrapbooking. Yeah. Wow, that would be nice in a card. Mm. Those houses, look at that. That's cool. That's a beautiful card. I want you could put that in a frame. Yeah. Thank you, you very much. Put that on our wall, on our travel wall. On our travel wall. <laughs> the travel that we did in twenty twenty. <laughs> Stayed home. <laughs> oh, that's our house. <laughs> Great for a recipe box. Yes, gift. that's yes, a good idea. Very good, nice idea. And I do like with these, like. Um, plain ones it's actually good to pop that inside your card like as the insert so you have no needy runs you can use the cards so Kylie yes, I I um, misspoke before oh, what did and you I'm say? sorry about that oh, what happened? so we have the hand penned yes we also have the hand pen ah oh, they do go together memories and more oh, cool so we could use any of these. Mm. We could grab one of these. Mm. That's covering too much of the beautiful. I know. It's still beautiful though. So yes, they do go together. Mm. I'm surprised they didn't come as a bundle. Yeah. But anyway. Well, we can get them separate. 
that's why we're doing this unboxing video to show you <laughs> that they go together wow that's nice mm. that would go nice with the mm. oh wow that's one that you could color, color. Mm. some stickers there i love this one that one's really pretty are you one. sure you can all see it seems very oh no that's okay yeah for them it's okay <laughs> for me it's just like <laughs> we can see yeah. <laughs> and there's the other side of that <laughs> hi tina petra <laughs> where flowers bloom where flowers bloom so, so does it's hope it's beautiful ladybird johnson mm. cultivate a good life beautiful oh that looks great again it's covering too much but that's just you can an chop idea it down a little bit or you can use this size yeah, if you don't want to cover ones. it yeah um they're really nice anything is possible so mm. you could stick that on there again mm. the the opportunities are endless. Yeah. Lots of different things there for you. Wow, some really nice ones mm, there. I'd like that on there. That's my combo if I was to do one. And what I would do is have the background um, do a layer in between of oh, maybe yeah. um, you know, another this beautiful blue here i'm not sure what that blue is actually bluey blue <laughs> yeah like a pool party just another layer in between would look really nice with a sentiment but yeah that's the memories mm. and more that are available on the pre-order mm. and that is called hand penned hand penned so if you want to add it to your start kit starter kit you can yeah. just search for the word hand penned mm. and there is lots of things that come up you can, mm. you'll see the sweep there but you'll also see these memories and more that's okay i'll just put it over here oh. now we're almost at the end Ooh. people not really but <laughs> okay <love> it. <laughs> so one thing you'll notice in the catalog is that there are would you like a dyes. cough cough i would love a yeah, cough let cough let me get another one for us we need a top up. I was like, oh, we're almost done now. We need more popping. <laughs> <laughs> so there, you'll notice that there are some dies in the catalog that do not have an associated stamp set. There's quite a few, but in the pre-order, there were two that were available. The first one is this one here called Taylor Made. Reminds me of you, Petra. <laughs> Taylor. And the second one is basic borders dies. So let's have a look at first of all, tailor made. Use the new fancy rectangles. That's a great idea, Shiree. Or Shiree. So you can never have enough tags, I say. And so lots of different sizes there. Um, lots of different, um, they look like buttons. Um, lots of different tags and things so um, that's that one that is the tailor-made tag Petra these will be available for the next year so no need to worry about that now this one here is called basic borders dies Wow and so you can see um, lots of different borders there there's this one here that will give you a beautiful um like you can have the like if you've got a card you can use this die here and so you have a bit that doesn't go all the way to the edge there's this one here which is almost like a um a envelope back there's this one like all of these you could use uh, for the top flap of the card so that it it doesn't go all the way this one here is like a cloud edge lots of different stitching uh, so anyway that's something that i don't recall ever seeing having um, dies that don't have an accompanying stamp set and there's two of them in the pre-order again the names of those are basic borders and tailor-made tags now interestingly the tailor-made tags is one that fits in the 
um, in the mini stamping in cut and emboss machine. Patty, thanks for watching. Kylie, I just um, want to show you these two. Yeah, I was like, what did I miss? Ooh! Some tags, but these ones here, I think will... Envelopes. Um, I was thinking envelopes, but I was also thinking, like, if you've got a card, you cut mm. in the top layer so that it doesn't go all the way to the edge. That's cool. Yeah. That's great. What else do we have? I thought there was a delivery, but there was no delivery there. They were just barking for no unknown reason. <laughs> <laughs> so these are host stamp sets. Oh. There's the Prince and Princess. Yeah. Better Places. Oh, I like the Better Places. It's very nice. Yeah. Natural Textures. Ooh. Now, you might remember our unboxing video. Kylie was a bit worried that... Oh, good. Kylie was a bit worried that one of the um, one of the texture stamp sets was retiring. I was. And I well, said, don't worry. That. There's <laughs> an even better one in there. And there this is, is beautiful. One. Like, oh. look at that one there, like a basket weave. There's a paving one yeah, there. Yeah, I like that. Um, that's like wood texture. This one here um, is like hessian. Mm. This one here, Better Places, beautiful little, um, you can just imagine that stamped and, and coloured on a, and cut out and put mm. on the stamp. This one here. Those scallop frames would be good with that. Beautiful. Mm. You did you did something similar with that beach frame. Ginny, you're here. Yes, you caught us live. Yay, Ginny. Hi, Diana. Yes, I agree. That's what it reminded me mm. of, the beach one. Yeah, the beach one. That's and this beautiful. one here, Prince and Princess. I'm not sure how I'm going to use that. Yeah, I'm not sure will either. I be able to, will I be able to do the frog and send it to Jesse? Welcome say, to the world. Hey, handsome. Hi, gorgeous. <laughs> Hi, gorgeous. <laughs> <clears throat> when Jesse's having a bad day, I can say, hi, gorgeous, and send I it like to the frog. Prince, Prince, and we all can't order them. Oh, sorry. It's annoying, Lena. Must have been popular. Yeah. So that one, you you can order them, but because Lena, aren't you in Australia? It must be out of stock. Really? Yeah, she's in our team. Oh, sorry to hear that. Now, mm. you probably saw in the catalog if you had it that there's an interesting option for host rewards. <gasps> I'm very excited about this host reward. <laughs> yes, like... those three sets are for host rewards. Yeah. And there's a fourth option, and that is, for the first time ever... <laughs> paper! Designer series paper. <laughs> this is and it's And it's not our just <laughs> any designer series paper. This paper is amazing. This is a set of 48 sheets. This is a big pack. So normal sheets of paper... Normal packs of paper are... 12. 12 sheets. So this is a whopping four times. Mm. So this is very good value. And yeah. this is really going to be very, very, very popular. Mm. And when you see it, you'll understand why it's going to be yes. popular. We're going not to be just using the fact, this all the time. Not just the fact that it's just paper, because mm. it's not just paper. Like, who no, says that it's just, just paper? paper. Oh, how terrible. Who would ever... What an injustice to the paper. <laughs> so, there's how many different designs? I don't know. So, of each design, there is four, four. sheets. Mm. So, ooh. Twelve designs. Oh, they're beautiful papers. There was a celebration a couple years ago yes, very similar I to that. Yes, that. Oh! Let me move our face out of the way so you can have full screen. Okay. Wow, that looks fun, that paper. <gasps> so fun. Hopefully this is available everywhere. That is a lot of paper. It is a lot of paper. It is a lot of paper. Yeah. But we're going to love it, chop it, and we're going to use love all hearts. of it. 
Sorry, everyone. I should have had this already. No, nah, don't apologise. This, this is, is like great. a. Um, this is the suspense of waiting to see what each pattern is. Ooh, there's like a pink tiger. Ooh. Ooh. Pink leopard print. Followed by pink candy stripe. Pink candy stripe. Followed by green. <laughs> Green flowers. Thank you for moving the coffee out of the way. <laughs> I only move it because I have experience in this area. Of coffee moving? Yes. No, of coffee spilling. Oh, I love that flower in this one. So. Whoa. Maria is watching us on video. Hi, Maria. Um, so, you can see that there is no specific theme no. to this very but patterned. just very pattern oriented mm. um, lots of different colors lots of different styles mm. and that's only one side of the paper and yes it's a whole remember set. there's four of each yeah pink leopard <laughs> randy Here and we let's go. go to the other Ready? side <laughs> oh! oh i was not expecting that that's exciting Wow. And the cool thing about black and white, particularly I love this one here, um, is you can use it, you can colour it to any colour that you want. You can use your sponging tools, the blends, and it will change that completely. And I'm so excited about stripes. Yes, stripes and this And gingham. dots, this one here. Yeah. I'm going to use these a lot. These could be coloured. Yeah. This is going to be really good. Very popular. So we definitely, yeah, and we can get it for free. I think in Australia, if you spend $310, you get this for free. And that includes demonstrators. So you spend the $310, but remember you get the discount too. Mm. Yeah. So whenever we have a host code to order, mm. they'll definitely we'll be, order be ordering this. one of those <laughs> we'll in every order. <laughs> But this is awesome. Mm. This is very... <laughs> yeah. 48 sheets equals 288 Love It Chocolate card fronts. I think Whoa. my maths is correct. That would, make, that would be yeah. right. So it's 72, 72 times, times 4. four. <clears throat> yeah. Yes, Lena loves that side as well. Yeah. And that's if you do it in the full size. Good one, Danny. Good maths. <laughs> well done. <laughs> so the next one we have is Linen Specialty okay. Paper. Good to see you. That's Jane Ian Bamford. Yes. <laughs> Jane Ian Bamford. <laughs> we know Ooh. you from your Facebook name. Ooh. Here we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> I wasn't expecting this. So, this is called Linen Specialty Paper. Here we go. Let's show you the linen. Can let you see feel, that? Let me feel it. Ooh. It's like... It reminds me of, like, the fairy stickers that I used to collect. It reminds me of canvas. Canvas, yeah. On the back, it's just normal paper. Yeah. In fact, is it a sticky? No, I don't think it is. It no. just has a normal paper back. Mm. Uh, no, it does have a sticky. Does it? Or is it just peeling it half? No, it's sticky. What? Which side's sticky? Oh, that side. Oh, I don't think it's meant to come apart, though. I do. Do you? Yeah. Hmm. What does the catalog say? So it's a hundred percent cotton. Wow. And how interesting. Um, would you be able to look yeah. in the catalog about? Sure. See what it says. About I'm pretty this. sure that that adhesive back is supposed to be like that. So if that's correct, then you could stamp onto this or oh, or color yeah. onto this color onto or. It. Maybe use some... I'd be interested to see what it looks like with the stamping. It would be under, you it's know, specialty. specialty paper. Yeah. yeah, with all the shimmer. Oh, yeah, here it is here. Linen. Linen. It doesn't say anything there. Two adhesive sheets. Oh, adhesive. Good call for an Tucci. But it would be interesting to see what how you would use it. Like, what... Um, you would stamp on or whether you would well those do flowers some... they would look like that vintage type 
stamp mm. would look really good with something like this, wouldn't it? That even, cotton. Even that stamp set that we're not allowed to talk about. Oh, yes. The on tour one. Yeah, that would look really good with that one. But anyway, yeah. linen. Yeah, and great. Like, you can't... <laughs> This, this isn't feel vision but <laughs> it's beautiful <laughs> cotton. Or smell vision <laughs> Yeah, that's very nice. Smriti used to do little canvas, canvas painting. Canvas painting. Oh. Yeah, we'd love to see what, what happens with that. Yeah, we'd love to see what you come up with. Um, oh, hi, Linda from Denmark. Wow, that's cool. So next we have All the alphabets some. would be good because it's already adhesive. Yes. That's a good one, Paula. You're all so smart. Hey, Paula, I don't know if I've asked you this before. Is it tarp or tharp? You have to tell us. What about dyes? You have to spell it fanatically. Yes, dyes would be perfect. Yeah, dyes would be amazing, Jane. Those those flowers would actually be gorgeous with that, wouldn't they? The cutout ones. Yeah, the cutout ones. The ones with like a hundred of them. Yeah. Not a hundred. Oh, see you, Randy. I miss you coming to our lives. So this is called Ombre Specialty Paper. Wow. The, the name gives it away that it's ombre. There's one of each in each pa in the pack. Mm. So there's four sheets. And they're, I'm guessing, mm. gorgeous grape. It doesn't say. Gorgeous grape. Um... Maybe Night of Navy. Night of Navy or mm. Midnight. Midnight Muse. No. Oh, that's a different one. Misty Moonlight. Misty Moonlight. <laughs> um, mango, I'd say. Uh, yeah. And this is probably Poppy. Yeah, Poppy. Mm. Who was that asking about the fabric design? Yeah. Poppy? Yes, Caitlin. Yeah. It's great. So this is, it's not shimmer paper, but it's mm. got shimmer in it mm. and there's nothing that will come off. No. Because it's just, it's a part of the... Yeah. Remember when we used to have shim glitter paper and the glitter would go everywhere? <laughs> yes. I do remember that. <laughs> but it was like, that paper's not allowed in this house. <laughs> so we also ordered some ombre bags, but they were on back order, unfortunately. Hi, Manon. She's from Quebec City. Oh. We've been to Quebec. It's a beautiful city. I love, is it Putin? Is that what, what I love, Bruno? What, the Russian president? No. The, the special... Ah, oh, the... You're right. What yes. is it called? Yeah, I think it's Putin. Yeah, yeah. Putin. Yeah, not the Russian <laughs> No, the, the chips with loaded toppings. <laughs> so these are silver and clear epoxy essentials. So you can see that they come in... Hi, Kay. From Queensland. Mm. So I'll show you Ooh, in these ones. I love these types. So these of are circle and. Oh, there's tear. There's circle. Oh, there's there's little... diamond <gasps> and tear shape. Wow. Maybe it, it's easier to look on the back. Yes. Oh, I'm excited about that. But they come in clear and and mm. silver. I love it. Chopper. I love the other epoxy dyes too. How's your coffee going? Do you want to see it? I um, think you need it. You've been working really hard, Bruno. You've worked hard for the money today. Who doesn't like poutine? <laughs> <laughs> it's the best. <laughs> so, um, the next I have to show you is... Loose Flower Flourishes. <laughs> Oh, they're cute. They're just little yeah. sentiments. They're in the, they're new in the in three colors. new ink colours. Yeah. yeah. In two different sizes. So there's a big one there and a small one there. Hey, Penny. <laughs> Finger Lakes. Yeah, I love that to, place. We have, have you been to Finger Lakes? Yeah. yeah. It's beautiful there, Robin. Here's another one. This is Baker's Twine Essentials Pack. And it's a set of five in neutral oh, colours. they are gorgeous. You're going to use them a lot. Yeah. That's so it looks like wanted. it's crumb cake, yeah. um, white, vanilla, black, and probably granite. Gray yeah, granite. it looks grey granite. They're really nice. 
very excited about those. Some ribbon, some woven Pale ribbon in, I think you're right, Pale Papaya. Mm. Oh, that's very nice. So it looks like it's a linen-y type. It's 11.30 here, Linda, in the morning. Oh my goodness, have we been talking for that long? <laughs> it's one hour and 24 minutes. Did you order the whole catalogue? This is just the pre-order, Diana. Pre-order, yeah. <laughs> Wait until we do the rest of wow, the order. Wow, this is very nice. Uh, this is like a linen-y, that, cotton-y. Textured, yeah, yeah, like that. That's really pretty. This one here is Garip Discussion Band. <laughs> <coughs> Which one's in English? <laughs> Which one's the English oh, one? Oh, there. Read the other one. Grow Green, Gross Green <laughs> What's Ribbon. What's the other language? Gross Green Ribbon, Ruban Gross Green, <laughs> Garip Geschenk Band. <laughs> Bruno's practicing his German. <laughs> you did German in school, didn't you? Ich habe Deutsch gelernt vor vier Jahren in der Schule. I did. I did Japanese at school. I hope you guys. I hope you guys are in mass. Genki desu ka? So that's nice. That is in French Highland Art. Heather. Oh, Highland Heather. And it's got a bit of a sparkly in yeah. it. Yeah. Jessie's going to love that. She loves purples. And she loves sparkles. So this is Ruban Texture. Textured <laughs> Ribbon. <laughs> oh, it's so hard to understand. Does everyone struggle getting this plastic off? The snips are the only way. <laughs> the other night, uh, last night, I was trying to undo the in-colour ribbons. And I was like, I cannot In the get, dark too. I cannot get this plastic oh that's beautiful oh feel that and look it has like a wood uh, can you see that yes it has like a wood, a wood texture, texture to, to it. it wow that's a bit special looks like gift wrapping yes and it's quite firm Very like firm. i thought it was soft but it's actually quite stiff yeah hi from washington state barbie, hi, barbie. purple's your thing too sheree <laughs> and no, we've looked at that one. That's the in cover. Petra speaking German back to you. Petra? Yeah. Itch ouch. Say... <laughs> Itch ouch. Itch <laughs> ouch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's probably saying me also. Me also. Ah, oh, yes. But that's A U C H. Is I it? Understood it yeah. oh. <clears throat> um, so. The last thing that we have, or well, second last thing, is these scalloped treat boxes. Ooh! I've T got some peanut butter M&Ms in the cupboard. TBH, I wasn't going to order these, but I did. Yeah, we've got to order it. Ooh, they're cute. How do they even... Oh, that's the lid. Mm. There must be another piece in there for the base. So that goes like that, I guess, and that goes in there. Oh yeah, good one. Well, that's cute. But there must be a bottom piece. Yep. <laughs> this is why I wasn't going to order it. I like it. Um, yeah, that would be it, because it doesn't oops, have the scallop. I just ripped it apart. Okay, so that goes in like that. Mm -hmm. And then I guess you glue that, yeah. And that's the base, okay. Right, yeah. okay, yep. So we'll just put that in like that, in there, and like that, in there. And so you can just imagine that that is glued. glued. And so then that would go on the top there. Donna's pre-order just shipped. Woohoo! How exciting, Donna. Yes, that's how it goes, like that. That's pretty cute. Oh, that's cute. cute. And so then you would open it. You can either take the lid off. I would just, yeah, lift, yeah, the, lid. lift the lid. Yeah, that's cool. I'd probably even tape that so that people wouldn't be tempted to undo it. 
That's cute. I really like that. I'm going to tape it while we're here. Because I think that's super cute. I'm just using tear and tape, people. I don't think it's in the new catalogue. What? Yes. It's got to be in the new catalogue. Is tear and tape in the new catalogue, people? Let's have a look. Surely tear and tape has to be there. It's one of I our, think that's one of the outrage. It's one of our favourites. That, that would give me outrage if tear and tape was gone. I would be very sad. Sorry if I'm wrong, everyone. Oh, you're just creating drama, Bruno. <laughs> I don't follow drama. Who are drama. you? No. Who are you? I don't follow the drama. The drama follows me. No. I don't want what the does, drama. What's Taylor's song? Yeah, I don't want the drama. But the drama... Oh, you've got low battery here. Uh-oh. I think we're almost finished there anyway. There's one that. more thing. Just grab that one. One more thing to show you, and this is only available for demonstrators. Yeah. Tell me. Tell me more. These are tabs for... Oh, it's reconfigured. So it's available, but it's reconfigured. Okay, good. Well, that's good. Because I love tear and tape. <laughs> it's changed number. It's being repackaged. Yes. Good. So these are for your catalogues. Love my little box. Look at it. It's so cute. Will it fit a ribbon in there? <gasps> it fits ribbon in there, people. Look, you can gift some <gasps> ribbon. There you go. A couple of ribbon rolls. Oh for my some goodness. <laughs> that one's probably a little bit. That big, will be but... <laughs> good for a team box. A team. That's a great gift. team gift. And then you can use all your shredding pa packing paper, Bruno. <laughs> He's always wanted something for his shredding paper. Thank you, everyone. Yeah. So that that's cool. I thought I'd just let you know the sizing. Oh, it's stuck to my thumb. Can you help me? Ow! <laughs> so back to me. <laughs> Was it ever not about you? <laughs> so this is demonstrator-only supplies. Just like these cups. Just like our cups. Have a sip while you're there, Bruno. I will. You put these on the side of the um, of the catalogue, mm. so it comes out as a little tabs. They're sticker backs. Um, I'll use Fest Dagen. <laughs> yes, it has other languages too. Yeah, there's lots of di like there's lots and lots mm. and lots, but um, it's in many different languages. Mm. And so, what you would do? Um, what can I stick it on? Um, how about Just this, this piece of yeah. grid paper? So imagine that this is the edge <laughs> of your catalogue. So what you would do is you'd stick it on the edge here. Ah. And then you would fold it along the little line. The there. little line. Right. Ah, and then you have like a tab. That's a bit exciting. And so then you have the other pages that you would be able to... Because knowing me, I'd probably do it like flush to the edge and then... <laughs> well, that would be fine because would then it? at least you'd have the... You'd, when oh, you're yeah, feeling true. along the side. Oh, yeah, true. So you can do it that way. Thanks for joining us today, Lin Lena. Bye, Lena. But then you, you would put them along and you'd just be able to see, oh, this is accessories mm. or this is the index or mm. this is... Um, mm. So where did I find these? This is under supply items. Mm -hmm. And we didn't get to choose the colour of the cups. No, the cups come, come in a pack, pack of pack two. Of two. Yeah. And this is called... Um, so if you are a demonstrator, you can look under supply items mm -hmm. for those. And if you're not a demonstrator, join our join. team <laughs> and you can order it as a demonstrator. I'll give you the link now. Join our team. <laughs> yeah. And my friends... That is our pre-order. Pre -order. And that's just a pre-order. Wait until the actual catalogue goes live. It goes live on Star Wars Day. May the 4th. May the 4th be with you. <laughs> so you can wait until the 4th of May to get all of these items. But why would you? When you can get 20% off once you join, you can get $66 of product for free. You can get free postage Free on top postage. Of it. And anyone who joins our team uh, also uh, gets given 
free tutorials. In our town, um, yeah. A card making class. Can I put that? Yes, good idea. Card making class. Uh, we have training, online training that you get for free. And we have a lot of team events and things like that as well. Plus, at the moment, we've got like an on-tour event, an on, on, um, online event that Stampin' Up! are putting on. And that's only for demonstrators. So there's a lot of cool things that you get as perks when you're a demonstrator. So it's definitely, definitely worthwhile thinking about it. No matter where you are in the world, anyone can join. Talk to the demonstrator that you order through. And if you're not sure who to order or who to join with, you're welcome to ask us too if, you, if we know anyone. Um, make sure you do a little interview first of the demonstrator you would like to join. It's very important uh, because you can't just go, oh, I've picked the wrong person. I'll just swap with someone swap. else. You have to wait three months to join with a different demonstrator. So it's really important that you work out what you want. For instance, we are not face-to-face -face at all. We don't do any face-to-face -face other than when the events were face-to-face, -face, which even they aren't at the moment. Um, and that may not suit you. So just ask questions, work out what you're wanting, what you're desiring, whether it's classes or creative support, creative ideas, business support. Maybe you want to turn this into a business. So really make sure that you're doing your research to find out who's going to be the best demonstrator to join with for you and your needs. Very important. Mm. Yeah. I don't know what you're waiting for. <laughs> it's Bruno and Kylie. They'll take such good care of you. Yes, we will. We definitely will. <laughs> <laughs> and Bruno, um, I think Bruno should do a technique video for card class. Yes, he's going to be doing one. It's the plan. We, he's we got wanted a list to get there. some um, some of these new products. Yes, um, we want to include new products. We want to have new the new catalog for the card class. Um, I think you said you were going to do something like an ice black ice technique or something Bruno there's something that I looked mm. um or mad yeah I forget yeah there's one that I found um that I would love to work out how to do it myself mm. so yeah it's going to challenge us as well which is a lot of fun but yeah we wanted these brand new products so that we can really show you how to use this new catalog which is very exciting Again, just um, if I can interrupt. Yes. We're showing these products because we want you to get them. Mm. Um, you can get them. Mm. Um, many people say you can't order them. You can you get can them. You can order them. You can order by them. By joining. By joining our team. <laughs> and we yeah. that's what we want. We yeah. want you to join our team because we have a really mm. vibrant group of demonstrators mm. who are self-motivated, that encourage one another, that share their creations with one another mm. and we have a really nice community so that's why we are showing them we love them we know you're going to love them mm. and uh, you can order them right now yeah caitlin she joined in may and she has no regrets caitlin's on our team we she... didn't pay her to say that <laughs> we love having caitlin on our team she was very apprehensive at first i know mm. a lot of people feel apprehensive because i think some of the issues is people think you have to sell you don't. We have a lot on our team that have joined just for the discount and we support them creatively. Um, we have like virtual swapping drawers and lots of fun for those who are just there for the creativity side of things. Uh, but those who want a business, we have support for them too. Um, so yeah, you don't have to sell. There's quarterly minimums, but it works out to around $120 a month with the discount, which is really doable on your own without having anyone else purchase from you. And the worst possible thing that could happen if you don't want to order anything, said who, <laughs> but if you don't want to order anything and you can't reach your minimum, Stampin' Up! are very understanding and they understand everyone has different circumstances. So you can ring them before you just go and drop, ring them first and talk to them about your situation. Maybe it's a financial thing they're very accommodating maybe it's temporary yep very helpful so ask them and also um you can basically just come back as a customer so no harm no you know no loss you just get a, f a bit of time where um you get the discount now diana asked a good question about on tour um it's happening this month in all different states in australia and it's an event online for demonstrators only and I think they've done it through Zoom. 
I've asked the girls who went um, last night and heard we really love you great on the team, feedback. Petra. Yeah, we love having you, Petra. Um, <laughs> I wish I could have joined. We wish uh, I could have asked We would well. love yeah. that too, Donna. <laughs> Um, but yeah, there's a really nice event and a, a lot of the on tour is um, basically looking at the new products, how to use the new products, but also tips on how to sell, um, yeah, a mix of both business and a bit of fun as well. So people said that those that went, they really enjoyed. There was one saw. last night here in Australia. Mm. So. We haven't, we didn't go to we that didn't one. Go. I don't know when our one is, actually. I don't know why we didn't I, pick the first one. <laughs> yeah, I think we thought we had to be in state, but right. you could go to any. So we just picked the Melbourne one. Yeah. So, no, it's really exciting. When you join Stamping Up, there's a lot of opportunities that come to you, a lot of things that you wouldn't get as a customer. So, And we still get all the same benefits, like the host rewards. Mm. We still re- receive those. Celebration time, we still get the free stuff, but we pay less. Um, so there's all those perks as well. You don't miss out on things. I think some customers are like, oh, but I'll miss out on rewards or uh, no, you end up with more. So, yeah. And it could turn into, like for Bruno and I, we never expected to have a business. So it could turn into something that you just never expect <laughs> with the right resources and the right tools and the education on how to create your own business. You never know what you can do with it, particularly in the times that we're in now. A lot of things are going online. I think that's the one we're going to as well, Angela. Yeah, the 20th. Yep. 20th. That's what we're doing. Now, it's sad to hear that um, I didn't realise so many um, was not, has, bleh, wasn't has was available in the United States. Mm. So if you want to share this video with um, your friends mm. and show them what it looks like, um, some of the papers that uh, we were able to get... I think um, out of uh, I'll ask you a question, then I'll mm. answer mm. me first. Um, it's like a TikTok video. <laughs> Tell me your favorite product from the pre-order. I'll go first. I'll go first. Um, <laughs> I think that um, there's two. Mm-hmm. The first is the host paper. Yes. Um, I think that is a definite standout, mm. um, something I was not expecting, and I think it's great. I think mm. it covers a wide range of different... And how much paper is in it? 48 sheets. Mm. Um, close second is the elegant Yeah, I knew you picked paper. that paper. Mm. The that was absolutely spectacular, that paper. Simply elegant. <laughs> Simply elegant paper. Simply elegant paper, so... Mm. Yeah. Mm. Jen, you should um, ring or message Stampin' Up and see if um, they can swap it for you. Because if you're going to miss yours, I'm sure there's another one. I am can... going to mine. You're going to... Oh, you're going, going to yours. Yeah. I thought you said going miss. to miss mine. Yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> so your yes. favourite? And it, tell us your favourite of yeah. what you saw. Paula said the hand-penned hand suite. Mm-hmm. Um, I think for me, if I was to pick, because obviously the, the paper is just always my winner, um, but looking at, I think that this one here, I'm very, very excited about. It probably would be, I'd be even more excited about if it was polymer, but I love sentiment stamp sets, and to have something that is really great just font, sentiments, yeah. just sentiments. To me, they are absolute winners, those types of stamp sets. So that's a winner for me. Winner, winner. Chicken dinner. Chicken dinner. And yeah, I think that I think these dies I was very impressed with and it sparked a lot of joy in me. That's the penned flowers. Yeah, the penned flowers dies. I'm really looking forward to playing with them. And that's same as Kay. Come up she with. said hand pen yeah. sweet. Yeah. I really like that. Pansy Suite for yep. Paula. Elegant yes. Paper by Card Stash, mm. uh, by Pat M. Mm. Kathy Bidney, Hand Penned. If you're watching a replay of this, please leave in the comments uh, mm. what your favourite uh, product that you're looking forward to um, getting. Or mm. Yeah, there's a lot saying, yeah, they joined for the discount 
there's a lot who in STEM. I think probably if we were to look percentage wise, it's probably only like ten or fifteen percent of all demonstrators worldwide that that end up doing it as a business. Um, and a lot as kind of not like serious business. It's kind of like oh, if I get a customer, it'll help me meet my quarterly minimum. And you so, don't have to be one or the other. No. Like. You- you could be in mash up in between. Yeah. Yeah. That's where I'm Like there's going. no box to tick. I'm going mm. to be hobby. I'm going no. to be business. Yeah. It's the same thing, but you can either choose to sell or not sell. That's yeah. the difference. Yeah. Oh, Beauty of the Earth. That was very nice. Yeah. Karen Driscoll. What is there to regret? Discount free stuff. Mm. It's just the win, win, yeah. win. Yeah. But I think, I think sadly there's been some other direct sales companies that have really scared people into joining because they feel like they're going to be pressured or, and you should never, ever feel that way. If you ever feel that way, you ring Stampin' Up because it shouldn't be happening. Um, because at the end of the day, you just come back as a, as a customer. There's no Stampin' Up police that are going to come and get you. If you don't meet your quarterly minimums, you just drop as a demonstrator. You no longer get the discount. Um, it's like wholesaler. If you're working with a company and you're getting wholesale products, you've got to purchase a certain amount to receive the wholesale, you know, discount. Mm. So it's the same with any other business. If you if you're not going to get the wholesale amount, then you're not spending the amount that they need that they require from you. So it's fair enough. We just had somebody um, (laughs) from our team. Um, She just decided that she wasn't. wasn't going to continue wasn't going to continue as a demonstrator she resigned she She didn't even wait till she dropped she just said look it's not for me and that yeah you have a choice to leave we added her to a VIP group and she can come back as a customer she can order it whenever she wants and that was Mm. no problem yeah Yeah. so as long as you know that you know it's very free it's very easy you have full control over whether you stay as a demonstrator (laughs) whether you spend whether you you know it's totally in your control and i think that's probably the key is a lot of people think that joining means pressure or reaching certain things and it should never ever feel like that and if you have felt like that in the past we're really sorry because it shouldn't have happened um yeah Talk to Stampin' Up. <laughs> Give them a call and let them know. <clears throat> yeah. So, I think, is there anything else? No. Oops. We'll have one one last look at Bruno's beautiful cards. The other thing, too, I do want to say is I really liked the Memories and More cards. Yes. <laughs> They're really nice. I just sold them over there and I'm like, yes, they sparked a lot of joy in me. I can't wait to play with them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll hold some over here. <laughs> love it love it <laughs> yeah the paper the colors the paper's amazing like the colors are really good yeah, yeah. um yeah. so if anyone as as we've all talked about throughout this if anyone wants to join our team mm. um joi joi can you add that? <laughs> yeah. um you, you can click on this link that kylie's just posting now if you um, if you want to go back and just watch the um, for the names, or if you need some clarification of what mm. the things are called, mm. um, just reach out to us. We'd be happy to help you with that. Mm. And um, and you can add anything. At anything, this time. not you just can these things. Add retired anything. product. You can add anything that's current at all. So it's really flexible, and you get sixty six dollars of product for free. Free postage. And free postage. So it's a winner. Yeah. So thank you so much for all being here. We really appreciate it. Check out our new tutorial bundle, by the way. Um, We've got one using the flowering cactus. Flowering cactus. You might decide to add that to your starter kit. It is stunning. And when you see this bundle of tutorials, yeah, I think you'll be very, very inspired by what these designers have done. 12 different videos, 12 different designs. Um, yeah, very exciting. Yes, the Baker's, baker's twine, twine pack. Yes, I agree. Yes, I agree. Oh, thanks, Paul. That Baker's twine is, you know, yeah. there used to be. I don't know if it's in the new. I don't think it is. Mm. Um, it was just natural. Yeah, natural twine, twine. or something. And you used to always, you'd be like, oh, Every, don't it, go natural twine. I think Brenna cried over that one. And this is. Yeah, so it's, it's nice to see perfect. it return in it a different perfect. way. 
Mm. Oh, here's something else. This is not Stampin' Up! related. Aww, cute. Um, this is a pin that I created. Mm. Um, what does it say it on there? It says, sorry, you will have to unmute. <laughs> We're doing a lot more Zoom these days. A lot days. more Zoom calls. <laughs> and so it's a, an enamel pin that I've designed. And I entered a competition with Impress Design Co. Mm. <laughs> um, and I won the competition. Yay! So, so I got 20 of these. And I gave, I gave one to Kylie. Aw, thank you. I like that because I have to remember to unmute. Oh, Manon, you, you are the best <laughs> dynamic duo. Yes, and also, go back what to was work. the other thing? Oh, yes, today I'm finishing some training. I'm very excited about this because I needed something to motivate me to get back to work. Um, and thank you so much for all the sympathy cards, oh, by the yes. way. Thank you so, so much. There's even more There's arriving. There's more that have come. So we'll do a part two of the yeah. video. So we've got more videos coming, more posts coming. Thank you so, so much. It's meant a lot to us getting those. It's really... I can't believe I forgot. I know. That was I like just top remembered. of my list. Yeah, I just remembered that now. But thank you. Really, thank you so much. So I, I started this training, um, these training videos because I was just, yeah, not feeling it with work and I needed something innovative to get get my mojo going again so i've done a, a training program on how to prepare for new catalog time so that will be released hopefully in the next couple of days i've done i'm halfway through so my goal is to get it done today <laughs> so i'm very excited about that so look out for that if you sign up for our newsletter um you will make sure that you get the update about that training program that we're going to be releasing and it's 10 videos that you can access forever. So, yeah, it's really good. Anyone who is in our, like, actual training already, demonstrator training, um, heads up, you'll be getting it for free. And so will our direct team members. So that's really exciting. We're looking forward to having that resource. And it will work for any catalogue at any time. Yeah, so it's good. Excellent. I think that's everything. Yes, a lot. A um, lot happening. Yes. Just back to the cards. Yes, the sympathy um, cards. Sympathy cards. If you haven't seen um, the video, we posted it on Kylie's channel. Mm. Um, and it's here on YouTube too. On YouTube. So mm. um, yeah, you can if see you those. just look, it, it was mm. posted about three or four days ago. Mm. So look under uh, sympathy cards that mm. we received and you'll see like... S it's beautiful, so beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah. And... As Kylie mentioned, there's more that have come mm. since then. So um, we held out as long as we're like, okay, I think mm. we've got all of them. And then literally the next day... There was 15. There was 15 <laughs> in the mouth. <laughs> thank you. It's so... Honestly, uh, being a Stampin' Up! demonstrator is so touching. And yeah. thank you very, very much. We just love... Love crafting people. They're just the most beautiful people in the world. It's just so nice. So thank you. Big hugs. Okay, so like this video, share this video, subscribe to our channel, click on the notifications bell, all of those things. Um, <laughs> we, yeah, we're we'll happy. We'll see you soon. Yep. We'll see you probably next week. I'm sure there'll be things happening on our blog. So definitely go over there. I know I've got some customer cards that we're highlighting on Tuesday. So there'll be a blog hop on Tuesday and lots of other things happening as well. So... Yeah, lots of ideas and creative support. Thank you for all your hard work, Bruno. Pleasure. You've worked hard today. This has been fun. <laughs> I'm going to have some we'll have lunch. To, we'll have to do a tidy tidy now. I'm going to have some. Having for lunch? I'm going to have some beautiful um, zucchini slice. Mm, I did gluten free zucchini slice. Um, I'm going to poach some chicken too now. The first thing that I want to do mm. is to put labels on the back of the dies, mm. and we have to choose a color. For the dots so that the new dots <laughs> so that um we don't get confused um excuse me why are you looking at me like i that? said we don't get confused i put the wrong dots on anyway <laughs> we're just talking now <laughs> good to see you all thank you thank you all bye thanks for your support um what do i press <laughs> <laughs> bye